A police in Norfolk will search the water of the River Wensum in Norwich today for a 55-year-old mother of three who's been missing since Friday. Gaynor Lord disappeared on her way home from work, but some of her possessions have since been found in a park in the city centre. Well, joining us from Norwich is Talk Today correspondent Nick Ellaby. Nick, what's the latest there this morning? Morning, Nicola. Morning, Jeremy. The latest is that... The search for the 55-year-old mother of three, Gaynor Lord, is now into its fifth day, which is very, very worrying for her family and everybody else. What do we know about what happened to her? Well, we know that she left work early on Friday afternoon, around 2.30 p.m., and was seen walking towards the Norwich Cathedral in the city centre. She then... As we understand, a witness saw her in this park, in Wensum Park, which is just on the sort of northwest edge of the city. Currently, police are guarding every entrance. There's a police car just down the road here. I spoke to an officer there who told me that the steel will be in place until they're 100% sure that they've searched every, every part of this park. And down the road, another couple of entrances, there's a police van and, and there's a children's play park there with, with a third entrance to the park with another police car station there. Lots of police tape up. And currently no one is being allowed anywhere near. Obviously at the bottom over the hedge, down the hill at the bottom of this park, you have the River Wensum. The police here in, in, in Norwich understand that, well, so they tell us that the most likely situation is that Gaynor entered the water, but currently it's a bit of a mystery. As I say, we know that Gaynor left work early on Friday afternoon, around 2.30. She was seen walking through Norwich city centre. Another eyewitness then reported her seeing in this park at around 4 p.m. Later on Friday, her clothes were found, but at different parts of the park. So a white work shirt, a yellow tank top, and then her olive coat was found in the water, which led the police to believe that she possibly entered the water, but the police here are not ruling out any possibility, including third-party involvement. They say that the, her disappearance is totally out of character. Later that evening on Friday, drone searches by the police here and foot searches found Gaynor's mobile phone and also rings as well. So they've been searching this area over the weekend with dive teams. They've also done foot searches and drone searches, as I say. But today we expect specialist dive teams, as soon as there's enough light here in Norwich, to go into the river and uh, ha have a proper look for her there. Well, thank you so much, Nick. We'll be, we'll be speaking to, to you again, sorry, in about an hour's time. Terrible echoes of the Nicola Bully case mm. there, isn't it? We'll be very, discussing that later worrying. on with, with Simon Harding on the show. But